For wedge alignment, set the master speed control to zero. Turn the swing on and ensure that the temperature is turned off. Remove the wedge away from the rollers by adjusting the depth out. Check for wedge looseness. Ensure that there is a 3 16 play at the tip of the wedge. Check for proper swing alignment by ensuring that the point goes into the hole on the back of the wedge arm. The hole should align with the pin squarely as it swings in. The pin depth should be set so that there is little to no deflection in the wedge arm as it moves forward. Check for wedge height first by using the vertical adjustment. The wedge height should be placed so that the tip of the wedge is square into the pinch point of the rollers. Check the wedge tilt. This is so that the wedge is going in flat. The two adjustment screws are to the left and right of the wedge, and it should be checked at eye level. The tilt should be even. The pivot point for the tilt is to the left. Check the wedge squareness. If the squareness is off, you can loosen the two mounting bolts and adjust the wedge a little left or right as necessary. The squareness should be such that the wedge is pointed at 12 o'clock and going in evenly to the rollers. Tighten when done. Adjust the wedge left to right so that it is centered on the rollers. The adjustments in the horizontal on the left side. Center the wedge onto the rollers. Note the deflection. The wedge stops and the top of the wedge arm continues going in. The wedge is adjusted out and rechecked. Slightly too much and just perfect. 